So something that I'm very glad that Ahsoka tackled pretty much right away in the first episode is Sabine's force sensitivity or lack of to be more specific because after all the marketing I was so confused. Is she force sensitive since they talk about her being a padawan to Ahsoka? But they made it very clear that that's not really the case as Huyang actually says that across all the generations of Jedi he has trained, which are many hundreds if not thousands of Jedi, she is the least force sensitive of them all. Basically meaning that she's not force sensitive at all. She might be able to touch the force just a little bit like almost anyone can. And that might be also what gives her quick thinking, great warrior capabilities and things like that. But that she's not a straight up Jedi. And honestly, I think this is perfect. I love that Ahsoka still decided to train her. And I love that Huyang is so supportive as I thought based on his very rigid programming he'd only want to train someone who's actually force sensitive. But he's really supportive of Sabine, and I think she's basically just a very proficient warrior being trained in the Jedi ways. And I think that fits, so I'm very excited to see where this journey takes her, and how she's gonna be able to handle someone like Shin without having those force abilities, as obviously the first encounter didn't go down very well.